Anaerobic activators are supposed to help speed up the curing of thread lockers in cold temperatures. Let's experiment. By applying thread locker on a bolt, installing a nut, and recording the length of time for it to set or fixture. And I did not make this up. The Permatex Activator Technical Data Sheet states that it promotes the speed of cure, and a typical application is cold temperatures. First, let's set a reference or control time at room temperature of 77 degrees Fahrenheit. By applying two drops of red thread locker on a bolt, installing a nut, allowing it to cure, and five minutes later, it was already set and able to hold this 9 16 inch wrench pretty fast. Now for the cold test. I placed these boxes of nuts and bolts and a tube of thread locker in my garage fridge for two days. I dropped the fridge temp and a cup of water measured 36 degrees Fahrenheit. And a nut and bolt measured 58 degrees Fahrenheit, which was almost 20 degrees lower than our control sample. Cold non-activated test samples were assembled with the cold nuts, bolts, and thread locker. Six samples were assembled and placed back in the fridge. After 15 minutes, the first three samples did not set. After 20 minutes, the next three samples had set and were all able to hold the wrench. This was four times longer than the five minute set time of the control sample. And after a 24 hour cure, the breakaway torque of the first sample was 3.51 foot pounds, the second 3.48, and the third 4.12. Next, the cold activated samples were tested. Activator was applied on cold nuts and bolts and allowed to dry in the fridge for 15 minutes. Again, six samples were assembled, and after curing for five minutes, all six samples had set and were able to hold the wrench. This matched the five minute cure speed of the control sample that was 20 degrees warmer at room temperature. Without the activator, the cold samples took 20 minutes long to set. And after a 24 hour cure, the breakaway torque of the first sample was 14.45 foot pounds, the second, 9.71, third, 10.59, fourth, 12.33, fifth, 11.46 and sixth, 10.72. So to recap, on zinc plated bolts, the warm nut and bolt took under five minutes to set and hold the wrench. The cold and no activator samples took between 15 and 20 minutes to set and hold the wrench. And cold with activator samples took under five minutes to set and hold the wrench. So the cold activated sample set about four times faster than the cold non-activated samples. And the average breakaway torque after 24 hours was 3.7 foot-pounds non-activated and 11.5 foot-pounds activated. So the breakaway torque of the cold activated samples was about three times more than a non-activated. Interesting.